Cause being in a shadow is just too much! Before there was Taylor Swift, there was Addie Singer, an unfabulous middle schooler writing songs in her bedroom to help her cope with the everyday struggles of teenage life. Stars and moons and shriveled prunes, frosted fruity flakes. Welcome to The Rewind. Today, we'll be counting down the top 10 episodes of Unfabulous. Before we begin, make sure to give this video a like and hit the subscribe button for good luck. Number 10. The List of Kissed What? I should be on here. Oh yeah, I heard about your kiss. It was on the cheek. There's a list in the girls' bathroom of all the girls who have been kissed by a boy. Addie will stop at nothing to get on that list, so she comes up with a plan to make it happen. When she finds out that Eli has a crush on her, she plots to get Eli to kiss her at the movies. Call me anytime if you want to go out movie bash. You know, as friends. I will. Number 9. The Little Sister Here we go again. Ben was my favorite student. Oh, he made the most fantastic model of the human heart. No matter how old a youngest child gets, they'll always be the baby of the family. Tired of living in her older brother's shadow, Addie sets out to accomplish something that Ben never could, get an article published in the school newspaper. Addie succeeds, but when she forgets to proofread the article, her name becomes famous for all the wrong reasons. Number 8. The 66th Day This wasn't an ordinary day. It was the 66th day since I started liking Jake Bahari. And the day everything changed between us. Addie has had a crush on Jake Bahari for 66 days straight and has written a total of 65 songs about him. She puts all of these songs onto a CD, but when the CD ends up getting lost at school, everything turns to chaos. Now Addie's on a frantic search throughout Rocky Road Middle School to find her sacred disc. Not wanting to even think about the consequences, she's determined to reclaim the CD before it ends up in the wrong hands. No! Number 7. The Pink Guitar That's Molly, that's Guy, and I'm Jolie. We're the C, U, T, of Q, and we're looking for our E. Ugh. So now you're like, cut. We all know what it's like to feel invisible. When Addie feels like no one is noticing her, she shoots her shot at fame and tries out for an all-girls band named Q. Addie can hardly contain her excitement when she's invited to join the band, but she's quickly disappointed when she discovers that the only thing the band really does is dance and pretend to sing. Now she must decide what's more important, being famous or remaining true to herself. Number 6. The Secret Do you guys think my dental health poster's the best? I do. I'm really good at drawing the teeth. Totally. You're so gonna win first place. <laughs> Sometimes the truth can be a tough pill to swallow. Thinking they're being good friends, Zach and Gina have been telling Addie little white lies to protect her from the truth. When Addie finds this out, she feels betrayed and goes so far as to draft up an honesty policy for her friends. Meanwhile, Ben has his own issues to sort out. He's either trying to hide from working for his father or hide from working at the juice shop. You're not going to tell Dad, are you? Of course not. You are. Number 5. The Party and That's exactly what happened to me. That's me, right there in the party. In the very first episode of the series, it's the first day of 7th grade and Addie and her friends are just trying to survive. Addie is hoping people will notice how much she's changed from last year and will start to recognize her as more than Ben's little sister. When Addie gets the chance to throw a party, she's determined to make it a party no one will ever forget. You okay, Addie? You, you know my name? Sure. You're my test class, right? Oh! <laughs> Number four, the last day of seventh grade. It was the last day of seventh grade, and it was worse than I'd ever imagined. 
The end of every school year is somewhat bittersweet. Obviously, everyone's looking forward to summer vacation, but it's also a time to reflect on everything that has or hasn't happened over the past year. On Addie's last day of 7th grade, she finds herself spending the day hiding from mischievous 8th graders as well as from her feelings for Jake. Jake! <laughs> Jake! Number 3. The Pal Janitors try to paint over it, but the wall will not be silenced. After Addie spends the afternoon playing video games with Jake, Gina warns Addie that she may have entered the ill-fated friend zone. This is more than enough to push Addie outside of her comfort zone in an attempt to get Jake to see her as more than a friend. Her sad attempt only makes things worse, and eventually, Addie comes to realize that she doesn't need to read Glossy Teen Magazine or wear six-inch high heels to impress Jake. Is something wrong with your neck? Don't just stand there. Touch him so he knows you like him. No, silly. Number 2. The Song Yumberger is sponsoring a contest for America's Next Teen Sensation. The winner will get to cut a single with <gasps> current teen sensation, Rob Hottie. Rob Hottie? Addie and Jake's relationship is put to the test when Addie auditions to sing a duet with teen sensation Rob Hottie. Addie's on cloud nine when Rob chooses her audition CD as the winner, but she's quickly brought back down to earth when she learns that the CD didn't have her name on it. After her attempts to claim ownership over the audition tape fall short, Addie starts to suspect that Jake sabotaged her chance at fame by removing the label from the CD. This is starting to smell like a fight. And it stinks. And number one, The Talent Show. Go on, Nancy. Say it. I love you. <laughs> We're gonna have to practice that some more. The school talent show is on the horizon, and Addie is determined to win first place with Jake's help. Unfortunately for Addie, Jake has to bow out in order to help out a friend with his magic act. When it comes time for the act, a jealous Addie takes it upon herself to crash the show. I love you, Nancy. I love you. I love you. <laughs> well, that's it. What did you think of our list? Before you leave, don't forget to give this video a like and leave your thoughts in the comments down below. Check out these other videos from The Rewind and don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell icon so you never miss another video again.